Maybe not. Aries, you have quite a bit of energies here. Aries. Don't retract into bad habits. Um, talk, therapy, counsel, very important. Um, you know what's right for you, so there is that energy too. Now, there is a wish that may come to fruition, but again, be careful what you wish for. Okay? Now, I do see here, moderation is going to be important. Self-discipline is going to be important. Okay, for some of you, love is showing up. Pay attention to your dreams. They may mean something. I do see your visions, your daydreams too. This is daydreams, this is night dreams. I am seeing that too, so pay attention to them. For some of you, this is also dealing with either a boss or someone at work. It's possible or in maybe finances um, and transactions. And you're just allowing these negative thoughts to come through. It's like you're kind of unhappy, but you're, you could be, you know, this could be, this is an energy where it's up to you. It's like you bring yourself down. Um, there are some things here that is wanting to be made clear to you. It's like the sun comes out, so to speak. Um, going with the flow is going to be very important. For some of you, this is landing a good deal. You could have just, uh, this is also, um, I wanna say uh, uh, financially being more stable. And some of you may have more money to kind of spend, have fun. This is good with pe uh, children or, or people younger than you. It's like fun-loving energy. Um, I do see dealing with a group of people. This could be going back to school, commitments being made. For some of you, this is love, happiness, being able to manifest it as well. But things take time. Let things develop. I am seeing here a lot of things that you want to desire. It's there before you. There is this energy of needing to take responsibility for your part um, as well. And, and then it's like, okay, maybe the other side or whatever. It doesn't want to take response, whatever it is. But when you take responsibility for your stuff, own your own stuff, that's fine. The universe knows who's right, wrong, so to speak, okay? Um, I do see here needing to be kind and to to yourself and to also nurture yourself take care of yourself be careful of overspending there is a lot of energy here that a lot of things that you do want it's there before you okay this is like you're taking care of yourself but at the same time you're dealing with either loss regrets there is some sadness here it's an up and down energy okay Balancing your time this week is going to be important, but you can get a lot of things done. The only things that's holding you back is some kind of worries and some kind of fears is what I'm feeling here. So this is a time of balance and self-discipline. Everything in moderation with money, um, addictions, or whatever it is. Everything needs to be in moderation here. For some of you, a love is coming in. This is like a fun time. Not, it's like, this is almost like falling in love. Um, it's romantic. For some of you, whoever it is, whether it's long-term or not, I can't see this exactly. You're going to remember this. It's going, it's going to be one of those romantic moments or um, something of a life in your lifetime. So I do see that kind of energy too. Matters of the heart, love is coming through. Things are going to move pretty quickly. This could be a fast moving week. I do see options and love is coming up. I do see dealing with contracts this week too. There is patience with others and tolerance is gonna to be important. I do see a difficult period ending and I do see this is like a lot of different energies are coming in. 
it's like fitting in with the crowd. Um, it's successful. It's, um, it, I'm seeing someone has social anxiety or something here, but it's like a new beginning with it. And then it's like, um, kind of like just being with others is actually, um, soothing and healing. There's victory success here. I do, I do, I do like that energy, high creativity, positive changes for you. Um, I do see you could be a lot, quite critical this week, even with yourself. Just be careful of not expressing. It's like your words have power, so you could be critical of something. So trying to see both sides is going to be important. Watch how you react to things. We can't control how other people are going to re react, but we can control how we react to things. Okay. Because this is a new beginner's mind here. This is, um, again, your words have power. Now, there could be that you're kind of hurt or someone said something, but maybe you're just a little oversensitive. Um, this is like a separating. You're separating from someone or something, so this could be a separation, okay? And I do feel that this, it's something didn't meet your expectations, but this is like um, new form of communications, love building, but again, this could be something that takes time, okay? Don't make promises you can't keep. Don't um, hold anyone to their word, because I do see people could be changing their minds here, too. I see also a Virgo energy here, or someone who exhibits those energies. Love, for some of you, is it's ascending. I like that, okay? Um, this is a focus on home as well. I see an Aries energy as well. I see a, yeah, Virgo um, energy here. Um, some of you may be traveling. I see things falling in place when you least expect it. This is um, getting what you want, victory, success here, partnerships, communications. This could be going on dates, um, get-togethers with friends. I do see that energy. Soulmate type of energy is coming through. Expect some sudden quick changes too, okay? I do see it's like something's been holding you back. And I do see here, do not assume or judge anyone without knowing the facts and figures, okay? I do see that it's rebirth. Something may be rehashed or something's being held back. You may be wanting to make some kind of decision, do something, you may not do it now, but it's like the universe is, it's almost like dealing with a karm, it's a karmic thing. So it's like rehashing the past and kind of putting a lid on something, but um, again, this is, it's important not to be judgmental with yourself or others this week because that's some kind of holding you back. 